we did it. <laughs> because I was like eating blue airheads but um today is February 3rd we have 10 days to the wedding so 10 days 10 days <laughs> so we have this is kind of nice light right here okay so we have 10 days for the wedding and I'm not going to lie, my body ain't terrible right now. Um, I've been working out these last two days. Um, I've been kind of working on, working out off and on in spurts. Um, I've just been really focusing on um, my stomach and my booty. Um, doing a little bit of arm workouts here and there because um, my shoulders are out of my dress. This video is not going up until after my wedding. So I don't care about telling you guys now. But my shoulders are out in my dress. Um. So I do kind of want, you know, this area to look kind of nice. Um, I do come from a genetically, I just have a wide back and wide. Um, this area is kind of always wide, but I do want to kind of work it out just so it's a little toned. Um, and I'm just drinking my water. I know the blue area is not helping, but I'm on my period, which is great because we got 10 days to the wedding. So yeah, baby Smith might be getting made. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay no just fine maybe i'm not but um i'm at home um i'm just pretty much doing some final things my bachelorette is this weekend my husband is fake my future husband is facetiming me so hold on y'all <laughs> okay after this this is all said and done i'm gonna do like 10 things they don't tell you when planning a wedding um 10 things to know when planning a wedding during the pandemic because baby one of those things is seating charts and guest lists. Like, oh my God, that is probably like the most stressful thing that we're dealing with right now is seating chart. And it's crazy because we're 10 days from the wedding. We should not be dealing with seating chart, but here we are. Here we are. But anyway, I'm about to work out. I have, have been finishing up last minute stuff. Um, my bachelorette is this weekend, as I was mentioning before. So um, it's a lingerie slash um, lingerie slash pajama party so um i'm gonna be in all whites of course all white lingerie y'all gonna see it so cute um so i want to be in that so of course i want my body to look decent don't that's dirty clothes over there don't mind that but i want my body to look you know decent it's not bad honestly like my body my body is not bad i mean of course i have this little sweatband on but i would say this for me to be in my period i am not that bloated which is great because that means I don't got that much to work on because <laughs> I know I am bloated. I know I am bloated. But um, yeah, I'm about to watch my girl um, Chanel Coco Brown on YouTube. I'm about to do um, this 15 minute um, ab and glute workout. I be sweating. Like these little 15 minute workouts do work. <laughs> so I'm about to do that real quick. Do a little nice little time lapse and yeah.
I'm a terrible, 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 terrible vlogger. Okay. Last time you seen me, it was Wednesday. Because today's Friday. It was Wednesday. I had 10 days. And my hair was curly. I didn't have my nails done. And I was working out. Um, well, today is Friday. <laughs> I have eight days. My hair is straight. And I have my nails. <laughs> so, yesterday was a busy day. That's why I didn't vlog. And Wednesday ended up turning into a semi-busy day, too. Um, Wednesday, it was kind of just me and my cousin trying to, like, get everything together, um, pretty much, per se. Um, because my bachelorette party is Saturday, um, tomorrow. Then yesterday, I had to record a video for YouTube, um, that will be going up the Thursday before the wedding. So, I'm trying to, like, I'm not gonna, I'm probably not gonna have a video. I might have a video the Thursday after the wedding, who knows. But, for sure, Thursday before the wedding, I will be having a video. So, I had to record that video, so to make sure that was done. And I got my nails done, and I also had to record a TikTok. I'm trying to learn TikTok. It's, it, it's hit and miss, but I'm getting better, and that's all that matters. That is all that matters. So, um, right now, I am waiting for my cousin to get off work because she's working from my house because me and her are going to my dress fitting. Um, it is the second to last one. Um... And next week will be the last one, and that one would just be, would just be me and my mom. So, super duper freaking excited. Okay, so excited. Um, and I got my shoes. I got my shoes. Um, since the, like I said, since this vlog is coming out after the wedding, that's why I don't mind showing you this. But look, this is a shoe. Okay, I am. And they're comfortable, okay? That's why I didn't want to get a super designer shoe. Because the problem that I have with designer shoes is that they're not comfortable. <laughs> so, um, and I I gen generally like Steve Madden heels over auto heels. Um, auto heels are just not that comfortable to me. Steve Madden is a little com bit comfortable. Um, I don't know. Like, all those shoes are... All those shoes are hit and miss. Steve Madden, I don't know. I've gotten the shoes from my bridal showers from Steve Madden. And they were super comfortable. I was able to be in them for three, four hours before I was like, all right, take these off. Um, those, the only thing that I have to do is because they are plastic, I do have to kind of stretch them out a little bit. Which I know when my with my feet sweating, they're going to kind of stretch and breathe a little bit. So I'm not that concerned. Um, I do have my bride slippers that I probably will be changing in at the reception. Um, I'm not changing dresses mainly because i just really love my dress and i'm just happy i just want to wear it okay i just want to wear it okay so yeah so i'm about to finish getting ready i'm almost ready i just need to put on my shoes um add some more jewelry and that's it and obviously I'm not, i might take you guys for the fitting because you guys are not gonna see it until after the wedding anyway so yeah i think i'm gonna take you guys for the fitting so really excited because this is a 10-day countdown to a mrs vlog um but overall how am i feeling obviously i'm very excited <laughs> if you can't tell i'm really really excited i'm really really happy i am just like the only thing that i'm nervous about is everything looking how I want I'm not nervous about I'm not nervous about marrying Garrick I'm not nervous about the actual act of marriage I'm just like is everything gonna look good because that <laughs> I'm a Leo that to me is everything gonna look good is everything is my vision gonna come to life um that's really it like that's the only thing that I'm thinking about but other than that like I know that this is the man I want to marry. I know that this is the man that God has made for me. And he made me for him. Um, so all of that is... Me and God, we here. We here with this ceremony. We here with this union. We're here with this contract. We're here with these soul ties. Like We're here with all of that. It's not that. Like I know my love is here. I'm not getting cold feet. I know at the end of the day, he got my back. 
It just isn't gonna look good at the reception though. <laughs> That's the only thing which um I trust my wedding decorator. I do. I do trust her. I'm just everything gotta look good, okay? That's the only thing. Which honestly the reception hall itself looks good. So it's not going to be hard to portray. So I'm not I'm not going to worry. I'm not, I'm gonna speak. My reception is gonna be beautiful, okay? Yep, okay. Stay hydrated. <laughs> so yeah. Um I'm about to kind of like shake out these nerves before I drive because it is currently snowing here in Detroit, Michigan. It's actually not that bad. It was a snowstorm yesterday, but it's currently like snow. So I'm gonna kinda like um relax and calm my nerves before I head out. Even though the streets honestly aren't bad at all. They're pretty good. Um, I've just, I've been driving since I've been 19 years old. I'll be 25 this year. It's only like five, six years. Um, and I haven't really had a winter where I had to drive in the snow. So, I'm driving in the snow. is kind of like, I know what to do and I don't know what to do. Like, I've never been in a situation where I needed to know what to do. If that makes sense. Which is a blessing. Knock on. <laughs> Knock on wood. But, um, yeah. So, I'm about to kind of calm my nerves down, say a prayer over this trip because it's like a 30 minute trip um and i'll see you guys at my city <laughs> i suck guys because <laughs> i was supposed to vlog at the fitting but i didn't because i was crying that is the exact truth i was legit crying um dang i can't turn this down um but right now i'm cooking dinner i'm with my cousin um we're watching murder mystery and makeup <laughs> and we're chilling and we're about to plan we'll figure out what's going on for tomorrow for the bachelorette but um yeah i know i suck um but i was just really emotional and i see my dress i'm sorry i got i got really teary eyed i'm sorry i cried real tears but tomorrow i should i should vlog tomorrow i should be able to first thing it's just gonna be a lot of twerking a lot of ass <laughs> all right anyway peace out <laughs> hi guys so today is my bachelorette i have spent the morning cleaning the house uh, making sure greg has food to eat i don't know talking to like talking like greg is a, like a pet or something but um i just like made sure greg has dinner tonight um well, I cooked, like, a big meal last night, so he has leftovers. Um, and, yeah, wanted to have the house clean for him just so he can relax because he never really gets the house to himself. So I just wanted to, like, kind of give him, like, a nice, peaceful, relaxing, um, you know, night. So I'm on my way um, to my pole dancing class. So that is the kickoff of the Bachelorette festivities. Oh, my God. <laughs> I am so excited. Um i'm really excited because the um teacher is actually a old dance friend and high school mate um she's like a great she was a great older than me but we danced together all from like the age of 13 till i was like 16 um we went to like we did dance company together and we did actual dance class together in school so i'm just like it's really about to just feel like old times all my girls are gonna be there i'm just like really super excited um so and i got my mask got my little bride mask so i'm really super excited i got all my stuff um the place is only like 10 minutes away so i'm about to hit there now and i'm about to try to get hyped up i'm already a little hype i'm starting to get hyped up now but i'm already a little hype so yeah <laughs> So after stalling for how long? <laughs> Hopefully <laughs> they're ready. It does. 
I wish it was a really nice apartment complex. Okay. I would, well, Gary don't like high rises, correct? Oh. Ooh. <laughs> I'm nervous. Give him a call. Hello. Hello. Can we come in? Yes. Ooh, I get rose petals. Ooh. Oh. This is nice. Thank you. Yes. Hi guys, good morning. Today is February 8th. We have five more days. And today we go to the city clerk to get our marriage license. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. The bachelorette was great. It was so fun. Um, I needed to rest yesterday, but, um, we really get married in five days. Okay, so, <sighs> okay, so just made it back from the rehearsal. Greg has a part, has left. He's going to do his bachelor party, so the next time I see him was when it will be when it's time to say those vows and to get married. Um, the rehearsal was great. I did cry. Um, I cried once with my singer started to sing my song. It was just like, bro, like I just started to get the feels. I'm soft. I'm a cry baby. That's me. I'm sorry, I just hit the TV. But I'm getting ready to clean that because I'm gonna have like a little wine night tonight. So, yeah. Yeah, so you guys don't want to watch me clean. It's not what you tune in to do, but I just wanted to give you guys a little what I'm doing for the rest of the day. Um, for the rest of the day, I have to break the rose petals up for my little sister's flower basket. What else do I have to do? Um, have to get my hair done. Well, get the prep for my hair, and I feel like there's some. They have to um tie the scrolls for the programs, and I low key and I gotta write my vows out on paper and write my um poem out on paper. So yeah, Lego. Okay, so I'm with my maid of honor, my cousin, and right now um we are making sure that everything that's going to the chapel is in one pile. Um, everything that's going to the reception is one pile in one pile because I have to get meet up with the decorator to give her everything that's going to the reception. So that's in that pile right there. Um, I broke away the flowers from my flower girl because we can't use real flower petals, unfortunately. And now we are doing the programs, which we had an assembly line. But everyone will be here later tonight around 6 or 7. Which is cool because I love we have a hair appointment in like 20, not 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Um, so, and then I also got my bridesmaids hangers and a nice little cute robe. This one says maid of honor. This is my cousin's. And then the rest of them says bridesmaids, if you can see it. Really cute, really cute. So hopefully we can get pictures of that tomorrow while we're at the thing. But now... I'm about to roll all of these scrolls. <laughs> oh my goodness. Are we running out? That was only 21. But we got 10 in there, right? How many we got in there? 11. So technically we would need... So 20 got started, so we probably need like 20 more. This is 11, and that's 22. I mean 21, so that's... 
Thirty-two. Yeah, thirty-two. So we need another. So we need another one of these. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'll tell my mom to get more. You want to okay. just cut the rest of it, just so yeah. we know for sure. Yep. Yeah, let's just make sure. Keep it going. Yep. Alright. Okay, just left my hair appointment. I know you guys thinking like, Mara, but what, what, what? Okay, but no. What I got done today was wash, um, blow dry, well, wash, steam, and then um, a blowout. So tomorrow she's going to come to my house. She's coming to me, and then she's going to um, finish up. So right now, because luckily I'm here before all the girls get here. So right now I'm about to, I'm getting all of um, my glasses and I'm getting ready to put them in the freezer for us. Because I just have this thing about my glasses going in the freezer. Now, like, I just, I just love my glasses in the freezer. I just feel like the wine, everything just tastes so much better. So I'm doing that now. Um, I'm putting all my good wine in the freezer. And tonight I'm making chicken and okra, fried chicken and air fryer and okra. So that is on the menu. I hope that's enough. Let's see. My mom, did my glass break? No. So I have a little bride glass that I'm gonna put in here. Ooh, no, I'm gonna drink out of this glass. I'm gonna drink out of this glass. I haven't used this glass in so long. Oh my God. Break it. Okay. So I'm gonna put you right. No, can you put you right here? Okay. So let's see. My mom, four bridesmaids, twin. Oh, okay. So technically, I got enough glasses. Um, but just case I have an extra one. So yeah, now I'm about to like just kind of straighten up, clean up. So as mentioned before, previous, um, we have to do the planners. Um, I already have not the planners. Lord have mercy. We have to do the program. Two people are getting their nails done um, today. We're getting pressed on. You can have wine and good vibes. All the wine is already um, in the freezer. I have I have two whites, a rosé, and I technically have two reds. But I'm gonna tell everybody like to bring a bottle of wine if you want. So let me. I'm gonna start prep cooking because I don't want to have to do all of that when I get here. So. Yeah. Which is okay because I'm about to take it out anyway and just let my hair be down and out. But we did it, y'all. We did it. And he looks so good. He looks so good. <laughs> I know y'all probably like what my dress looks like, but y'all just gonna have to wait until later. So we're about to head to the reception hall. About to turn up, have fun. 
honestly I might not record I'm probably not because I'm gonna be having fun and drunk and high so yeah <laughs> Wendy's. We need to. <gasps> I'm not taking my time. <laughs> you do. I don't take my. I was running. No, you was in the first seat for the longest. I have on slippers. You was in the first seat for the longest and was wearing those slippers. I was having slippers. <laughs> I'm trying to. I'm trying to. You're going to do it. Okay, you lead the way. <laughs> Damn, what? Oh, you're right here. That's amazing. <laughs> Guys. Oh. I'm going. I'm coming. Can you open the door? <laughs> it's a bed. <laughs> But I really about to eat first. Huh? I'm about to eat. You had a whole bottle before you left. <laughs> That's why you was crying. <laughs> That's why you was crying. You were actually good. We're live. <laughs> we're live. We're in a hotel now, and my dress is so. This shit is gross. Look at this. Had fun though. Had a great time. Woke up this morning a little hungover, but I downed a bottle of water and now we're back in business. <laughs> but we're cleaning up the room um, so we can go home. We kind of upset. We should have just went home because we did not want to get up. <laughs> we did not feel like moving. But it's over. We kind of woke up like we ain't got shit to do. We ain't got shit to plan. Nothing. We're just... We're not consuming shit. shit. We can finally get back to living life. So it's back to regular scheduled programming. So thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Um, it might have been a little bit everywhere, honestly, because it's been a 10 day wedding countdown. And the 10 days before the wedding is the craziest. Um, but um, I am going to be doing like more wedding, not wedding related videos, like things you need to know when planning a wedding, things you need to know uh, when planning a wedding during a pandemic and things that they don't tell you. So I will be doing like other videos now that I've actually gotten through it all because baby, baby, it's a lot that people just don't think about that you have to think about. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Hit that like button and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video whenever that will be because I need to recover. All right. <laughs>